Hey guys, welcome back, and uh, we're, we're still going, we're still rocking and rolling. Um, I've been doing a little bit of work down here, as you can probably see. Um, I've, I've put in like a bunch of extra roads to kind of fill this in, because I was, I was looking at this from kind of down here, and um, it, we haven't got the density of buildings that we should have. Oh, buildings burning down. Uh, it needs to be it needs to be denser there needs to be a lot more buildings down here so um, so I've put a bunch of those in um, and we need to zone them in because I haven't zoned them in garbage is piling up god dear everything's going to pot guys it's all falling apart <laughs> nah not really right so yeah you can see like um, I've added in all of these little spur roads to kind of fill this in it should look a lot nicer once uh, once all of that's populated so we'll kick off and we'll just we'll just zone these areas in. So anything that anything that isn't already zoned, zoned. Boom. I didn't do. I there's still still a few areas that I want to fill in. Now, oh, I have been getting it in the neck big time from uh, Nanny Giggles for removing another building's burned down thanks very much uh for removing the nanny giggles baby bump i have now been known i'm now known to, to nanny giggles as the baby bump murderer thanks very much that's really nice so i've got to find a new location for um for a baby bump roundabout so i'll do that at some point um right having done this we can let this like carry on and uh, and get on with it and grow and all that kind of stuff which will which will be very cool now i want to have a look down here because if we go to um like one of the subway stations oh by the way i'll just point out have, like have you noticed that like my lag's gone away now some of you will be saying ah yeah that's because sky's installed his new gtx 970 card graphics card uh, no, I haven't, because my GTX 970 graphics card turned up, and the damn thing doesn't work. Now, I think it's a it's a, a problem with the, the motherboard that I've got, because I've got quite an old motherboard. And uh, I don't think... Apparently, there are some problems with the, the, the motherboard BIOS for old cards with the 970. Like, my 670 works perfectly, but 970 just will not work, will not boot computer won't start so it puts me in a, oh god I, I've got a bit of a problem I've, I spent like a long time playing around with it I can't get it to work so I think I'm gonna have to upgrade my motherboard the problem is if I upgrade my motherboard then I'm gonna have to upgrade my CPU I'm gonna have to upgrade my RAM so I'm basically talking about getting and virtually and building a new computer so that I can use that 970 card and um, <laughs> Like, I've kind of spent quite a bit recently. Like, that 970 card wasn't cheap. And by buying, like, the Blue Yeti and the audio equipment and stuff. Oh, man. So, uh, not good. It's not good, guys. Um, right, what the hell was I talking about? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I wanted to show you this down here. Um, so, let's have a little bit of a look at the, um, the, the subways. So, I'm going to go over here to uh, public transport. Here we go. And I want to show you, oh, look Look at all these people hanging around, waiting for, for trains. And also, that's a dog, uh, unemployed. Um, that's a worker. Oh, that's the metro station. Come on, let me click on these people, will you? Ah! Uh, unemployed. Unemployed, a worker, a dog, uh, that's a tourist. You know what? Let me come around. Let me come around this side. See if we can get better. That's a tourist. Uh, that's a worker. My point was going to be that there are a lot. Oh God, I'm getting lots of tourists. I, my point was going to be. Look, uh, there's a lot of these people are unemployed. Yeah, unemployed, unemployed, unemployed. Right, and I think this is what's um, causing. Um, some of our unemployment problems so we're gonna we're gonna like eventually do some stuff to fix that um, we need to put in bus routes we need a lot of buses around so, so people can actually get around here it's um, it's there's a limited distance of how far these people will actually walk to get to places they will walk a fair way but we really need buses so a, a lot of that if we look at our unemployment I'm guessing it's going to be around 15 16 percent 15 percent at the moment which is kind of not fantastic. Um, talking of subways, 
we uh, we need to do like a fair amount of work on our subways up here because let me show you now we've got this subway route that goes up here right which is all fine and dandy except that um, we need to add in this section here uh, which um, which is going to be like the, the all the way up Fifth Avenue so that people can actually go and shop here and we've got we've only got like three stops there we need to put subways in for all, like all of this up here and you can see that our old subways have gone so uh, we need like a, a redevelopment of the subway network and I think we probably need to do this sooner rather than later so you know what I'm gonna I'm gonna relay the, um, the 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 subway. I'm gonna strip out all the old stuff and then uh, and then we'll we'll kind of redo it. So uh, so come back in a second. Okay, you know while I'm doing this, I keep meaning to do a 60 second tip to show this, but I'm I'm just gonna show you what the hell. And I'll, I'll I'll do a 60 second tip at some time. Um, so I've 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 cleared out the uh, the subway tracks from up here. Uh, we need to clear this area out as, as well and, and redo some of this uh, but I wanted to show you now we've got a we've got a, a line uh, going along here um, but of course all of our lines are green and it's very difficult to see like what's what well you can you can change that and, I, and like a lot of you will know this by now but it's it's kind of a bit of a, a strange way that they've implemented this um, the way that you access these lines to be able to manage them is you have to click on one of the vehicles So like here's a subway train that's on this line if we uh, if we click on this subway train We see we get this little button here modify the line right and now we can go in and we can change all kinds of stuff right um, we can change the color of the line which is this is like staggeringly staggeringly useful so for example we could say you know what we're gonna make this we're gonna make this kind of bright red right so it'll be easy to see um, and what else uh, it tells you how many weekly passengers you've got how many tourists all this kind of stuff really really useful stuff and you can change the name of it so we could change this to whatever we wanted to call it um, and I'll probably do that at some point but there you go. So that's how you do that. And it's the same with the buses. So like over here, we can modify this bus line, change the name, change the color, all that kind of stuff. So now we should be able to see that this line goes down here and round here and up here. And basically it's a bit of a mess, right? So this needs to be redone. So what we'll do, We'll get rid of uh, of this line. So I go into modify line, delete line, and boom, gets rid of it in one shot. Excellent stuff. Right, so I need to bang in um, some subways along here. So, huh, how am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? I, I see. It looks like we need to do a whole thing here. I, this is why. It's like so much easier to put this stuff in like after you've built a city than it is to kind of do it as you go along. Because every time you change something, you got to kind of re like redesign everything. Which is, uh, what the hell am I knocking down there? I have no idea what I was knocking down there, but I'm, <laughs> I'm sure it was something important. Okay, right, so having got rid of that, now we've got like bits of oh, oh these are just trains so that's okay that's cool okay now do I change this I think I probably do so yeah let's let's change this as well all right okay so now we can bang in like a whole bunch of subways and then we'll hook them all up and hopefully it's gonna help us quite a lot uh, so, first of all, bang my subways in. So, I want these guys... Um, so we've got a station now. I guess, like, a station... Come on, come on, go there. One there, and then... One there. I do like putting them on the corners. Then we've got another one there. So, we probably want one maybe there as well. 
Okay, cool. And then... Yeah, we can forget that side. We need some more up this end. So, I'm kind of putting them like every, every two or three streets. So, if we've got one there, we'll want one on this corner. And then... On this corner. Now... I think up here we'll have one like going across here and we'll do I think we're gonna do a loop I think we're gonna do a loop up here kind of makes sense and I gotta say yeah yeah this yeah this is working this is working so let's let's mirror it on this side so we want one come on come on it's, it's kind of tricky sometimes to get them exactly where you want them come on See, what you're supposed to be able to do, right, if, if, right, this is aligned to this street. If you want it aligned to this street, you, you should just move the mouse closer to this street. But it kind of doesn't always work like that. No, it's not going to do it. Right, it'll have to be there. It'll have to be there. Um, where did I put the next one? There. So it's going to be here. Yeah, probably on this corner. And same, same dealio. I can get it. I couldn't get it right, right in the corner. Okay. Stop moaning about it. Get on. Build. We want to see building. So let's. Um, most of these can be hooked up. I think. Basically straight. So yeah, we'll. We'll hook these guys up straight. Because it's just a bit easier using the straight tool. But um, then the top bit needs to be a bit curvy. So we'll, uh, we'll use a curvy tool to do the top bit. And again, we've got, I, I took out a bunch of um, the uh, bus routes that were up here because it all got destroyed. So we're going to have to put those back in. Now as you can see, we've got bus routes, these blue lines, all around this area of Central Park. So we need to do the same. Uh, up in in this top area, and right, let's finish hooking these up with the straight tool, and then we'll switch to the to the freeform tool. Is that is that everything that we need? Yep, that's everything that we need. Right, so freeform tool. Oh, now that's a curve tool. So let's run this up here. We have a nice smooth curve. Keep the trains running nice and quick. Here. So you know what? I might bring that out even more. Okay, so now we can start putting our lines in, and uh, I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to do this. Now, I could do a, a, a circular route, but I don't think I'm going to. What I think I'm going to do, I'm going to start from. My, and it's, it's a good idea to be kind of at a slight angle, I find, because it's then easier to see these these things sticking up. So we're going to start up here, we're going to whiz down here, picking up all of these stops along the way, and this one, and this one, and we could do the same thing as in New York, we could have like local routes and express routes, that'd be kind of cool, I might put an express route in somewhere, that'd be kind of good. Now, do I just bring it down to here? And like call it a day so that people coming down here have to change to get onto this line. You know, I think I think we probably do. I think we probably do. So let's just take it back up here. Uh, this one and this one and this one. This one. Boom. Boom. Boom and this one there we go right now let's do the same thing over this side so let's this one and this one and this this now this i'm really hoping that this is going to help our employment issues so ah so we'll come down to here then, because we've got another line that comes up here. So we'll go as far as there. Is there any point in me going a little bit further? 
you know what I'm actually going to go one stop further and then come back up and up to here and here and here God, you you got to love doing this stuff haven't you designing all these lines and stuff cool right now I, I should colour code these but I'll, I'll kind of do that later I think um, hmm now, what is that complaining about? Oh, there's a, a missing bus line there. Can I, can I get rid of that missing bus line? Yeah, there we go. Got rid of it. Excellent. And you can see there's, there's dots all over the place that I need to get rid of. They're the old bus stops. Them and loads of the damn things all over the place. Yeah, you'd think that when you got rid of a road, that it would actually get rid of bus stops. Well, like on that road, look at all of these damn things that you got to like find and get rid of. Okay, cool. Right, having done that, right, so our people should be able to whiz around here now. So yeah, well let's crank that up and let them uh, let them get doing that. So cool, people can actually get all the way up here now. Now I did take out that uh, that little spur that was running across here, and I think it might be nice to let people get from uh, from one line to the other, but. Yeah, I think what we're going to do is we're going to wait. Rather than put that in now, we're going to get the um, the east side because we've done we've done the west side or started to do the west side. The west side is going to go all the way up here. We're uh, we're going to start to put the east side in. We'll put a line up here and then we'll put some some cross lines in. But I'm thinking we're probably going to have another line that goes up from here, uh, maybe up here, maybe it goes out to the burbs, up towards the Bronx. That might be uh, that might be kind of a cool idea. Right, right, cool. Right, oh, right. So now it's time to start knocking stuff down. Esterford Paper Mills is going. A lot of you are probably go about blooming time. You've been on about it for enough time, Sky. It's about time you actually did it. Right, that's it. All gone. Esterford Paper Mills has gone, and the. Uh, the the final thing we need to do is actually just remove this. So um, we'll just wipe it out. Here we go. And up to the edge. Try and, try and make it reasonably neat. There we go. Lovely. There. And Esterford Paper Mills has finally gone away. Right. Cool. Now, uh, d developing the east side is going to be kind of important because um, it's going to provide uh, employment for this and we're going to exp be expanding 50 shades up here and then this is going to go up here and obviously we've got fifth avenue now um do we've got to do park avenue as well no i guess park avenue is going to go up this side kind of kind of sort of um yeah yeah cool um should we let's take a quick look at our uh our numbers unemployment's up to 20 percent right now so um things and things are not going good but i think it's just a case of um, we need some bedding in for this season we're ripping so much stuff out that it's kind of not good but we're going to provide uh, some assistance uh, where where we possibly can now before i get on to doing the east side there is one thing i wanted to do down here now a, a lot of these buildings will be complaining uh, not about workers but about, see this one, not enough buyers for products. They can't ship their products out um, and, and get them sold, which is not good. So I think we're going to try and help them out a little bit. And where can we put in some commercial? You know what? We can put some commercial in here. This is perfect for a bit of commercial. Yeah, absolutely perfect for a bit of commercial. Yeah, you know what? We're going to we're going to dezone this bit along here, and then we'll put in a nice patch of commercial here, like it, like that idea. Now, uh, if I use my marquee tool and dezone, 
Oh, it's, it's at an angle. That's the only problem. Which makes it, I probably should have used the brush. There we go. Right. And then we'll paint in all of this. Bum, 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 bum. Round here. Round here. I'll have to check out how this is um, how this does because we will need some parks and stuff around there i think i'm just going to zone that in for now and this is high density right so this is kind of going to be the border uh, between the the high density and then the low density going out towards uh, towards long island cool and oh and somebody said that i've actually got um queens and and brooklyn the wrong way around apparently queens should be up here and brooklyn should be down here <laughs> i never spent a lot of time in uh, in brooklyn and queens so my bad my bad um there was something else i was going to tell you guys now i'm kind of desperately trying to think what it is um this you know what there's a lot of extra bits of space in here that i should probably zone in like that and that should get all of these little little messy bits and pieces zoned in there we go there we go excellent so a bit more office space down there desperately needed desperately needed right more more stuff burning down i'm gonna keep uh, nanny giggles baby bump uh, for now to remind me that i need to put in another one because otherwise nanny giggles is gonna kill me she's really upset about it she's like i, I can't believe you knocked that down oh man um uh, right i know what i was doing i was um I was going to do give these guys some more help. So as well as putting in this bit of um, commercial over here, we're going to give them a train. Now they've got the, the docks down here. Oh, and I did put in, because somebody was somebody was left me a comment and said, oh, that's, that's a nightmare, the roads you put in. So I've put in um, this nice road along here. It's two-way. Two and then just here, because there's quite a lot of traffic comes out this way. Um, I've added in a couple of uh, one-way streets feeding out into these streets so that these trucks can get out pretty easily. And I've got to say, that's working fairly well. Fairly well. It's a little bit a little bit sticky this way, but it's, it's coping. Just about coping. Right, so let, let's, um, let's bang a train in. This is going to be dead easy. So what I'm going to do, so that these guys have got another outlet for their goods... Uh, is we're going to put in a train, and this is this is how I'm going to be doing uh, my cargo trains from now. On. Where's my trains? Here we go. So this is just going to be like a single spur. So we're going to pop it in like there, and then I'm just going to take a track. Uh, we'll freeform this. So I want to come like I think we'll put in quite a quite a cool. Bridge. So I'm going to take this up to yeah, about like that and then run it across here. Then we'll take it down again. There we go. And then we're just going to like whiz it up here. Nothing too clever. And this is just going to be a spur. So this is going to be like trains can come in. They can, they can deliver, drop off. And just go out, and uh, there's going to be there's going to be no network there. Now, if I want to, if I want to, which there's a very good chance of, I'll run another spur into this area uh, to give these guys a train. So, like they've got there's a train, uh, actually a train station there. We'll rip out all of this other stuff, and we'll just put in one. I don't know, maybe maybe along here or something, and we'll just run a single spur in, so the trains can just come in, drop off, and go out. And then we shouldn't have any of our nightmare traffic jams. But I still do want to put in a traf uh, a, a passenger uh, thing kind of dealio. Right. Um, up here. We, we need to start developing uh, this area up here. So this is all looking a bit bare. Can we put some stuff in? Yeah, go on then. Kind of like that. And then go up there. And then we'll hook up there as well. Cool. Sweet. Right, so what I'm going to zone in there is some uh, some high density residential, and I will cover like this, pretty much this whole area there. There we go, and then the, we're going to have that transition from the from the high density out to the low density out here. 
this is I, I think we're going to have maybe a bit of high density here and then it's going to be switching to the low density as we go up here so that'll be our kind of our transition point um, could probably do with like a spur road in here yeah let's let's do that let's put in just a little spur road just to kind of fill this in uh, am I gonna yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna put in a little crossroads not crossroads there we go this is going to be low density. Low density. Boom. There we go. So we're starting to fill it in. Starting to get it filled in. Right. The east side. Oh, man. What the hell? Are we, oh, oh. Oh. A little bit of lag. Did I have a save going on or something? Oh. Right. So we'll get rid of this. We'll get rid of... Yeah, see now I'm not quite sure whether I should get rid of that or not. And I'm I'm still in two minds about exactly what the hell we're going to do about this um, this freeway running through here. But you know what, guys, I th I think that's going to have to wait for the next episode because we've run out of time. So you know what, come back and we'll do the east side.